Hey guys, so talk about my very, very first day as charge nurse. It was not today, actually, but uh, talk about my very first day as charge nurse. So, a little bit of a background. I got my nursing license, found out I passed the NCLEX on mine and my wife's wedding anniversary. So, the middle of September, I found out I was becoming a nurse. And then, I started working very soon thereafter as a nurse. Uh, so, right about probably the very, very beginning of October, or the very end of September, I began working on the floor. After that, I worked on the floor under a charge nurse, just as a regular floor nurse, until Thanksgiving Day of my new grad year. Uh, so, like I said, I just graduated at the end of July, I believe. Just found out that I got my license, or passed my NCLEX, middle of September, and so I've been working for a little over one full month and then like most of November uh, and that's it and so I show up to work Thanksgiving Day my new grad year look at the schedule and it says Chris 300 hall charge nurse uh, my heart sank so on the unit on the, the facility I was in I was always a 100 hall nurse uh, and it went like this it was the 100 hall was your regular long-term care facility patients um, you know your residents that live there um, they don't go anywhere they are your residents um, for one way one reason or the other 200 hall were your rehab patients patients that will probably leave patients that are there for assisted living sort of um you know not really uh residents sort of like roommates or you know people that are there for for a shorter amount of time and then the 300 hall the 300 hall was lockdown psych it was it was, it was a lockdown unit there were two padded rooms i believe there were padded rooms in this lockdown unit uh, mainly geriatrics, uh, very, very few younger folk, but mainly geriatrics. So, <laughs> come on, look at the schedule, and it always tells you your assignment at the time clock, and it has my first initial and my last name, 300 Hall Charge Nurse. Well, there's another person working at the facility with me, and their first initial is a B, but they have my last name. We have the same last name. Uh, and uh so i was like oh okay well maybe it's b you know she might you know she might be the, the charge nurse she was like the weekend program director weekend uh director of the facility i was like oh okay maybe it's b maybe she's here on a holiday or whatever you know let me let me go check on my 100 hall so i go to my 100 hall my usual charge nurse says uh chris let me know if you need anything uh we're gonna get through this day together uh you know it, just, just call me if you need me. Just page me over the phone. Let me know. And this was uncharacteristic of, of this individual because we were, you know, we were a team. I was on the 100 hall. We were a team. And my charge nurse is talking to me like this is the last day she's ever going to see me. I'm like, what are, you, what are you talking about? She's like, you're the 300 hall charge nurse today. I was like, oh, this is fantastic. Uh, so I go to the 300 hall. Very, very... Uh, slowly anxiously you know my my stomach is in knots i am not at all ready to be charge nurse on a new unit and i've been a i've graduated nursing school two months ago not ready for this at all i show up i do my count just like i would if i was taking my cow but i do the count you know with everybody because i'm charge nurse now uh, i have two med techs that are going to do my med pass i have it's me my med techs, uh, and I think I have like five or six CNAs, and that's it. And so all the meds that the med techs can't give out, I have to give out. All the uh, NARCs and uh, various other meds that, that they cannot give out, I've got to give them out. So I'm doing my med pass. I have a fight. Of course I have a fight. It's Thanksgiving Day. Why would I not have a fight? I have a fight. I have to talk to various family members on Thanksgiving Day as to why... I am calling them about the fight that we have. I have other patients who are harassing my CNAs. 
I have other patients refusing to take the meds from the med tech. No, I want the nurse. Well, guess what? I'm the charge nurse. They don't recognize me at all. No, I won't, you know, whoever else. Uh, no, ma'am, I am I am the nurse. No, sir, I am the nurse. Oh, well, I don't want you either. It was a nightmare. <laughs> My charge nurse from the 100 hall came down at least one time when I did get an order to give Howdall to an individual through the gown. The doctor said, literally, the doctor literally said, get that Howdall in them. I don't care how. <laughs> I said, I said, okay, yes, sir. I completely understand what you just told me. Yeah, we kind of, we stuck out all in that individual. And the doctor did not care how. <laughs> so it was a nightmare for me. Um, It was a terrible, terrible day. And I just had no choice in the matter, you know. I could have just quit and that been it. But, you know, I have like two or three fights break out. I have patience harassing my staff i have just it's just the terrible you know it's it's it was just a nightmare and here i am a brand new new grad the one thing that i had that would probably that probably benefited me more uh than anything is at that time i was 28 or 29 i can't remember which i gotta remember which one in school i think i was about to turn 30 so i was 29 and I believe that my age kind of helped. One, because I was old enough to where I kind of knew, uh, not that I knew everything, you know, I, I, so that I knew I didn't know is, is what I'm saying. You know, if I'd have gone into this at 22, 21, been a brand new grad, and all of a sudden, you know, a month into new grad, I'm a, I'm a charge nurse, I don't believe I would have asked the questions to my 100 hall nurse that I did ask. I don't believe I would have taken the time to pick up the phone and be like, hey, 100 hall nurse, what is it I need here? And so, yeah, my meds were slower. My treatments were slower. Uh, a lot of things were slower because I took my time because I understood I don't know. Um, you know, and it was, you know, I got through the day, but it was a nightmare. Uh, it was no fun at all. And then after that, I became one of the old charge nurse like quite often. Uh, it, was, it was like it was a trial by fire uh, from my facility. They just kind of slammed me into this uh, <laughs> charge nurseness. It was terrible. Luckily, my staff was phenomenal. My CNAs were great. Uh, you know, I had to thank everybody quite often. Thank you guys so much for everything that you do because I don't know what I'm doing here. My staff was wonderful, even though I had patients brawling in the floor, fighting it out. On Thanksgiving Day, uh, you know, everybody wants to watch the Cowboys play football, but they want to watch them on this TV or that TV or this TV because it's Thanksgiving Day and that's what you do. And they're fighting over whatever it may be. <laughs> it was just a disaster. Your very first day as charge nurse shouldn't be fun. It should teach you a lot. And I learned that's probably the one day in nursing that I go back and look at probably the most in my mind that I learned more things that day than I've learned in any other single day uh, in my nursing career. Oh, what a day. What a day. In any case, if you like that video, like this video, check this one out over here. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe over there. I hope it helps. Thank you much.